back on the lawns at uh, One to One Investment in Cape Town. Francis, thanks very much for taking the time to speak to us, first of all. Thank you. Could you give us a little introduction to, to yourself and, and to the company? So, uh, I'm, I'm a geologist by background. Um, I've been with uh, the company Exor Resources. Uh, we've just gone through a name change. We were previously Novo Litio, but Exor Resources for about three years now. Um, I'm technical director at, uh, at Exor. Um, Exor is based uh, in Perth, where ASX listed. Uh, but our, our project is in Cote d'Ivoire, Ivory Coast in, in West Africa. Uh, it's a gold project. Uh, it's a very exciting uh, exploration project um, with targets ranging from uh, sort of green fields all the way to pre-resource. So we are aggressively drilling uh, the project. Uh, we acquired it late last year, so we've been aggressively drilling for around about two months now. Um, and we're aiming to have a resource uh, sort of end of Q2 of, of this year. Uh, we're very well funded from the company's previous life as an exploration company in the lithium space where we made some discoveries and um, sold one of those discoveries. Uh, so we have 15, approximately $15 million in the bank, which um, obviously funds a lot of, a lot of exploration activity. So um, our, our takeaway message that we're, we're spreading here is um, that we're uh, probably one of the most aggressive junior explorers out there, um, very well funded to do so. Um, uh, we have two rigs currently operational on site, one RC rig, one air core rig. Um, drilling a number of targets, um, one of which is fairly close to being a resource. Um, and we're looking to uh, turn around a maiden resource um, in, in the next few months. Um, in, in the shorter term, we'll start to see drilling results uh, being reported uh, to market for, uh, for the uh, first couple of months of drilling that we've, we've been doing. So we look forward to keeping people updated on, on those results in, in the coming weeks. Very good. And just from a sort of geologist perspective, what would you say about that, that particular region of, of Cote d'Ivoire? What are some of, the, some of the features that you sort of highlight? So we're in the north of Cote d'Ivoire. Um, we, our immediate neighbours are formerly Grand Gold, now New Barrick, uh, who have uh, what, what Mark Bristow has, has called uh, their most exciting uh, exploration prospect in West Africa, uh, literally abutting our tenement, the Bundiali project. Uh, there's also the, uh, the Tongan Gold Mine, which is 40 kilometers away from our, our, our licenses. And there's other uh, operational gold mines, such as Sisinge, held by Perseus Mining, a long strike from us. Um, so we are at the, uh, the uh, confluence of two highly prospective greenstone belts uh, in northern Cote d'Ivoire. So the Sayama Gold Belt and the, um, uh, uh, the uh, uh, Tongan Banfora Gold Belt as well. Um, we're essentially at the intersection of those two belts, which is, uh, we think is a, a, a very prospective place to be. Um, it's a very tightly held area. Um, it's essentially ourselves and um, Rangel Barrack are now the main uh, landhold, landholders in the area. Um, so we believe that makes for a very exciting uh, you know, uh, cocktail, if you like, with our, our good ca cash position as well. And you've had uh, lots of meetings over the last couple of days. What sort of response have you had from investors and how have you found the conference overall? I found the conference very, very good. I think it's, uh, uh, not wishing to, to plug it too much, but uh, I think it's, it's reached just the right size. Um, we've, we've had some very interesting discussions. We've had back-to-back -back meetings um, throughout, um, so it's been, it's, it's been very useful. Um, and the feedback has been 100% positive so far. I think very, uh, people are very excited to see what we're going to be reporting in, in the sort of coming weeks and months. So, um, uh, yeah, it's been, it's been very positive. Well, best of luck with the uh, continued drilling process. Thanks for Thank your you. time today. Thanks very much. Cheers.